Bridget Burgess from BMI Racing. I'm 17 years old and I'm originally from Brisbane, Australia. I do now live in a small town called Tooele, Utah. Right here, this is my daily driver and it's the Corolla FX16 GTS model along with its original motor and this was my track day car also. And unfortunately from the track days, I did eventually blow up the motor. However, I will be swapping it to the 2ZZ motor from the Toyota Celica, and that is a project for winter. That's another project along with my off-road truck, which is the Pro-Lite from the Lucas Oil Off-Road Racing Series. It has over 530 horsepower, and I will be doing another project and be working on my Asphalt Modified, which also has 530 horsepower. So I have a total of three projects over this winter, and I can't wait to start working on them. So back in Australia, my parents had a workshop along with a CNC machine, which my mom would use to make parts with, along with doing wiring on many JDM cars, along with my dad doing all the fab work and the welding. My parents had the ultimate dream of moving to America and to go racing. They did everything it took, and they made it happen. I moved here with six suitcases and built an amazing race team. This year, in 2019, I got to complete my second year in off-road, along with starting to race Asphalt Modified. My best finish with the Modified was fourth place, and that was behind the state champion, track champion, and the runner-up champion. I was also able to do two K&N races on the west side. The difference I found between the off-road truck and the Asphalt Modified was going into a corner and having different brake applications and entering into a banked corner instead of a flat corner like the off-road. And then also going out of a corner with different throttle application and finding the limits of the tires without spinning out. It was a great opportunity to go testing with Bill McNally and his team. Having a driver's coach by my side to teach me better lines and also having a crew chief to help me set up a better car. It was really cool having that experience and working with the team and also driving an A1 car and it responded great. I'm looking forward to 2020 because I will be doing a lot more asphalt racing with a little bit of dirt.